What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ty, and this is my crib. Come on in, let's check it out. Alright, so as you step in, the first thing you see on your right is actually a closet. No, this isn't supposed to be a shoe closet, but I just don't want shoes anywhere in the crib. I like it to be minimal. So I put all my favorite shoes here. Margella Tabbies, you guys know I wear this like way too much, like every day, like every other day, like I, I put this on. Uh, up top, I have three boxes to store like random wires, accessories, and like PR packages, all, all, all that sort of stuff. Now, moving on from the closet, directly across we have the visitor's washroom. This is the creme de la creme, it's super clean. Anyone that comes over would always want to use the washroom. It smells amazing. I got like lavender. I actually picked this up from like a lavender farm the other day. Um, yeah, love it. You guys know me, you know I like to cook. I'm on my health wave. This is the kitchen. This is where I get to work. First things first, we got this fruit baskets, all sorts of stuff on here. Air fryer. I'm gonna put you guys on some sauce real quick. If you don't have an air fryer, you're sleeping. You're just like on your bed. You're you're going. You're sleeping. Like this is this changes the whole game. What you been cooking in there? Uh, last night uh, I actually made um so broccoli. Right, I know this sounds weird, but you cut your broccoli up, you season it a little bit of olive oil, seasoning, put it in, put some chicken thigh, chicken breast, cook it up, and it's delicious. The broccoli is like super crunchy, and I have it with like hummus. You guys know me. I love my goddamn hummus, man. But speaking of hummus, I just want to show you the fridge. This fridge is super clean, super modular. I love it because it blends in with the space. Up top, we got the fridge, soy milk, chia seed, pudding, carrots, yogurts, arugula, tomatoes, hummus, and of course my broccoli. I, I wasn't playing. Look at this. It's a forest in here. Mm, more food than me. Yeah, I be eating, bro. I be, I be eating, I be eating good. And down here, we got the freezer. Not too much going in. I pretty much ate all my food. I need to head to the grocery store again. Here, we got the spice rack, or I like to put like just coffee, just like sauce, seasoning, that sort of stuff. I feel like you have to separate your seasoning from like your sauces and various other things. But that's just like that's just me specific detail there, right? Up here. Here's where we got breakfast items. We got like creatine, protein shake, you know what I'm saying? All the good stuff, all the good stuff. Now moving on, my spice cabinet. This is, it's a bit of a mess right now and I, I will do a video showing you guys how to like clean up your space, make it more minimal. You have a lot of storage. You know what, you know what, you're right. I, I do have a lot of storage, but I, I use it pretty wisely and I've used it pretty full actually. There's like no more space left. Um, I don't know, I'm doing something wrong, but I will make a video showing you guys how to like make your space more aesthetically pleasing, all that sort of jazz, you know what I'm saying? But moving on, we got down here the dishwasher, clean dishes. I just, I cooked up last night, so you know me, um, did what I have to do, did what I have to do, you know what I'm saying? Is that iPad right here? Yeah, it's an iPad. I usually just use it for like cooking recipes or YouTube or like music usually. It's always a vibe when you're like, if you come in on a regular day, like I got music blasting and it's like, you just like would want to stay here and not want to leave ever. But moving on from here, we got the Nespresso machine. Nespresso actually sent me this like a couple weeks ago. They were like, hey Ty, do you want this? You um, drink coffee? Oh, all the time. I drink so much coffee. It's actually a problem. Like, like my eye starts to twitch sometimes. Like last year I had to go to the hospital cause I it was like, my heart was beating too fast. It was, I drink coffee and a story. All right, that's enough of the kitchen. Let's go into one of my favorite places in the crib, the living room. This is where everything goes down. This is the creme de la creme. I, honestly, I, I love spending time here. It's just so peaceful. Look at the look at the tall ceilings. It feels like you're, I don't know, in heaven. Maybe that's an, maybe that's an over exaggeration, but I just absolutely love the, the tall ceilings and the windows. To the right of me, we have this beautiful poster of ASAP Rocky and Tali Creator. 
doing what they gotta do. Some of my favorite artists, if you watch my videos, you know I've done videos on their style and how they dress. Following the poster, we have this mirror, six foot mirror, I got it from Ikea. I hunted down this mirror for so long. It's like, it's called the Hobet mirror and it's very popular. I, I, it took me about like three months for it to be in stock. But basically I have it here so I can make sure the drip right, you know what I'm saying? Look at the drip today. I'm saying a little fit check, a little fit check. Anyways, anyways, anyways. Gassing me up so much, gassing me up so much. <laughs> here we got the chair. I actually found this out of Vintage Antique Store. I love this shirt, it's super comfortable. You just lounge in it and forget your problems. Okay, I am not forgetting my problems. I have to finish this video. <laughs> okay. Who's this, bro? This is bro. This is my homie right here. Uh, Where'd you get that head? Oh, wait, I get the head? <laughs> <laughs> well, I actually picked what this up. What do you up. mean by that? You know, yeah, no, what are you asking me? Where'd I get the head from? Where'd you get this head, bro? Oh, oh. I got that from Home Depot. I was there yesterday and I they saw They was giving up free heads? Um, no, I had to pay for it. It was like oh, money. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. I wish it was free though. Okay. It would've been blessed. Now I'm moving on to the other side of the living room. This is where I sit down and chill, wind down, relax, all that stuff. This lamp here really sets the mood at night. I have like an RGB light in there. I put it on like a deep, like yellow, maybe or like a red magenta sometimes, and it's just vibes. Vibes at night is vibes. crazy. Vibes, straight vibes. Damn. <laughs> but moving on, we got the posters. Travis Scott, Frank Ocean, and Tame Impala. Some of my favorite artists and some of my favorite albums. This is an art piece in itself. I picked this up actually from a poster sale, and I bought the frames, and I my guy bird a whole three piece setup. It looks like it should be a lot more expensive than it is. But below all that, we have this couch. Very comfortable, it's literally velvet. You can fall asleep on this and like never wake up because it's just like, it's that comfortable. Like I'm not, like it's just like, wow. I'm amazed at how much comfort is in this piece of, wow. Okay. Sit on it. Sit on it? Yeah. All right, but. Sheesh. Oh. Yeah. I'm in, I'm in heaven, bro. That's it for the character. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, what got going on here? One of my favorite pieces in this crib is the telescope. It's it's it changes the whole game. Like, I have a really big window. Might as well take advantage of it, right? So when there's the moon here, the stars, you never want to look at the sun. Do not look like the sun's out there right now. But if I looked at this, I would be blinded. Like my retinas would burn. Don't look at the sun. But I use this to, to stargaze, to look at the moon at night. It's very beautiful, it's a good experience. If you don't have a telescope, get one and put it to use because you will be, it's, it's, it's one of those moments where you realize that you live on a rock and you look at the moon and you're like, the moon's just another rock. I know this kind of feels up, it's kind of deep, but moving on from that, moving on from that. <laughs> moving on from that. This right here, this is the king. Ty himself in full glory. This was actually made by one of my friends on Instagram. He's a, a Parisian artist from France. He designed this up in Demi and was like, yo, do you want this? Like, yes, please. So he shipped this over from Paris and I, I framed it instantly because I was like, yes, I, I need this in, in my house. All right, now let's go to Magic Happens. Come on. This is where the magic happens. And by magic, I mean sleeping because I love to sleep. Get your eight hours every day because it's good for your skin. This is where you get dressed in the morning. I have a little setup here, a little, a little vibes going on. We have a little trophy bowl to hold up all the jewelry and a little mirror plate beneath to keep all of the drip. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? We got everything on deck. Um, here's one of my favorite rings, actually. This is a, it's a dragon. I'm actually gonna put this on. Coil, coiled around. I love this ring. Kind of looks like Chrome Hearts, but it's not. So my favorite colognes by Rado, De Los Santos, Gris Dior. This is actually from the same Dior event that I was speaking about earlier. They gave this out amongst other gifts. Um, I'm wearing this right now today. It smells exquisite. Yes. Exquisite. That's the word. The only word to use to describe it. Um, here we have a Mercedes Benz SLK 171. Why do I have that? Um, I just really like Mercedes Benz. Like I have a toy car. Like 
okay? Like, what are you really gonna do about that? Like, sue me, okay? <laughs> We have a salt lamp here. It's really good and nice. It's for the vibes. It has atmosphere. It's not really that bright, but it looks good. Here we got the round mirror. So when I'm getting dressed, putting on all the jewelry, lotioning up, you gotta look at yourself. Make sure you look good. That was look good. <laughs> so the bedroom is a little bit more elevated than the living room. And I love to stand up here and just watch the view. At night, you can see all the city lights. And during the day, it looks magnificent. The view from down below also looks Spectacular, wonderful. Um, one of the reasons why I actually moved into this crib was that it was a two floor unit. This is my first time actually like getting my own place. And when I stepped into, the, into this place, I knew that I had to get it because it was just like so magical in the sense that you can go upstairs and still see down below. And it's just like one huge space. There's no cutoffs. It's just like a loft. And it's really perfect for one person because I live here all by myself. Okay. Here's the bed. I have a queen size bed, all white vibe, all white aesthetic. I'm super minimal in the sense that I like to keep my space clean and clutter free. I, I love this bed, it's super comfortable. I have a good night's sleep here. To the left of the bed, I have this lamp from Ikea. It's the mushroom lamp. I actually hunted this down as well because it's so popular, you can't actually get your hands on it unless you get it when it drops. Um, keep, I keep my Apple Watch here. This candle smells amazing it's the golden gate park scent uh, i got this in san francisco um and it's just like oh, bro smell this smell this smell this Woo. yeah it smells yeah uh, i don't I, I just like i'm a loss of words it smells so good yeah moving on into the walk-in closet uh this is this is where the drip happens this is where i get dressed um all my clothes are here it's like a two Two wall uh, closet, two corners. Have a lot of clothes in here. Everything I wear, I got dressed in here this morning. So from the closet here, we have the in-unit washer and dryer. I love that it's actually right next to the closet because it's so convenient. If my clothes are dirty, I just toss it in here, wash it and dry it, and boom, put it back right where it belongs. In the trash. I'm just kidding. That's a come on, bro. Yeah, yeah, I'm kind of dripped out right now. You can't say that in the video. Bro. I'm just kidding, dude. Can't say that. You kidding, bro? Yeah, dude. You kidding, dude? All right, moving into the ensuite washroom. <laughs> this place is so nice. It's super clean. I actually love that this whole entire wall is made out of like plexiglass and it's clear and it reflects light in the morning. We get the sweet, sweet sun rays coming in. But yes, I, I designed this place all by myself. San Francisco poster, the Golden Gate Bridge. This is the um, sink. And I have a little, little good vibes going on, a little good vibes going on. This plant actually is fake. I, you know, I love real plants, but you can't really keep them alive in the washroom. So I, I had to get a fake plant. This is actually a real plant. This is lavender. It's dried lavender that was actually given to me on a PR trip. Went to a lavender field and they had all sorts of lavender products. And they were like, do you want this dried lavender? And I was like, yes. Um, I have this basket here for towels. It looks really clean and really soothing. It has a really good texture and it pops out of the bathroom. Um, up here, this art piece, I, I made myself. I got a frame and cut out a page from a Supreme uh, coffee table book and I put it in and it looks like a really expensive art piece and it's not. Um, yeah, and that's the vibes in here. I absolutely love spending time in this washroom. Super clean. You know, I step like this. You are not stepping like this, bro. Mohair, chrome hearts, spin around one time. Uh, 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 uh
on this table here actually I have some plants that I'm growing uh, this is mint and yes I can actually just pick it out and eat it um, I didn't actually take it and you can like grow plants you can eat I only thought you can grow house plants which is like kind of dumb but I have oregano here it hasn't really started to grow but it's it's in the works it's in the works it's just soil right now of course my monstera plant love it surf is kind of loud out here we know we are outside but moving on to the other part of the balcony here we have a little bit different plants this is a desert plant it's called yucca as you can tell i'm probably like a plant dad um, i love my plants i love i love my house plants uh here we have basil this basil is gonna come in super handy when i'm growing uh when i'm cooking like pizza or like whatever whatever dish you want to use just put a little basil in there um we got this chair super comfortable and let's just sit here and relax look at the view look at the lake look at the cars going by the birds the skies fresh air of course the best part of the balcony is this view i absolutely love this view but yeah that's the balcony come back in all right, so that wraps up the condo tour. I hope you enjoyed me showing you around my beautiful place. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and drop a like. Comment down below what you want me to do in the next video, what you want me to see in this crib. And yes, peace out.